The Petroleum and Natural Gas Senior Staff Association of Nigeria has issued final warning to oil and gas companies over unfair labor practices. The union gave the warning at the 7th Zonal Delegates Conference in Lagos. Senior correspondent Sharon Ejasso reports. It's the 7th Zonal Delegate Conference of the Petroleum and Natural Gas Senior Staff Association of Nigeria, Pengazen, which took place across the country. At the Lagos Zonal Delegates Conference, the chairman of Pengasan in the zone, A.M. Ebeng, urged the incoming government to prioritize the need for functional refineries in the country. He also said that this would create more jobs and put an end to importation of petroleum products in the country. The protection and security of the jobs of our members and increased welfare of our members. Within the next three years, we will work assiduously with Mr. President and other organs of the association to ensure that we create more jobs and ensure that most of all our refineries come on stream. Because with more refineries working, more jobs will be created. We must do everything possible to protect our members. The national president of the association who spoke on the theme of the conference, repositioning trade union to combat anti-labor policies of government and employers, urged employers in the oil and gas sector to treat workers well in line with global best practice. Remembered our deeds. So that is why, even in our closet, even as a branch chairman, you are there alone with your MD. As a zonal chairman, you are sitting alone with the CEO. You should be able to take the right decisions that will affect our members positively. Because their employment is guaranteed by us. Because their pay rise is guaranteed by us. So we should not lose sight of that. Workers who have served the association meritoriously received awards during the event. With the several challenges of workers in the oil and gas sector are faced with, especially the issue of casualization of workers, it is expected that the new crop of leaders will prioritize decent work in the sector. Sharon Ejaston, TVC News, Lagos.